This is Jason Kincaid from TechCrunch headquarters, and we have a special guest who just walked in. Who are you? Well, I've been known as Santa. How's that? That's I even have jingle bells to prove it. Candy canes in the basket. He is well equipped. He is definitely. And look how tall. Look how tall he is. I'm six feet tall. He's. What, how tall are you? Six um, six. Six feet eleven three or something like oh, that. Wow. So I'm not really sure. Um, the lifts and the heels and the boots do help. You know? <laughs> Giving away all the trade secrets. So, so what brings you to town today, Santa Claus? Well, there's a very special collaboration going on with Microsoft Windows 7 and Southwest Airlines. And we Santas at 20-some-odd um, airports around the United States are giving free family pictures. After those kids have found their coats and their shoes going through security, they'll have an opportunity for an interlude, immediately upload it, send it to Grandma, and I think that's a wonderful thing. So, so for Christmas, Microsoft is giving all of these families free photos with Santa. Yes. Awesome. Good job, Microsoft. I like Thank this. You. <laughs> so, so what have you been up to today? I, I hear you're kind of touring the city. Have you been meeting with tourists? And We've been having all kinds of fun. San Francisco is really a destination place. Uh, and uh, some people are a little surprised that before Thanksgiving, here is the full regalia Santa. But candy canes and a smile do uh, carry a long way. We've been posing for photos with all sorts of people. Oh, can we have a picture with you, Santa? Well, certainly you can. So. We, we just took, by the way, like 10 photos with Santa Claus. This is the happiest day of the year <laughs> by far. Uh, so tell me a little bit. I, I overheard you talking a little bit that Santa is social. What do you, what do you mean by that? Well, we Santas have years ago, uh, started about 17 years ago, 10 Santas who had filmed a commercial together, after the filming was all over, decided it would be fun to get together. The 10 of them got together in the last weekend in January, and now it has grown, so I will be going down to Southern California to Knott's Berry Farm. I will be one of 150 Santas. We'll all take a big, huge group picture. We have several seminars. and. Are you dressed as Santa Claus during this group outing? Uh, yes, but Santa in the workshop model, Santa casual, not necessarily uh, with the uh, winter tux, if you will. So, so tell me a little bit more about Santa casual. What does that entail? You got like suspenders on? Or? Oh, well, sure, and uh, every Santa is unique in what their interpretation is, what casual Santa is. Uh, green pants, green sweaters. There's even a Santa who has a blue uh, sort of... Um, uh, Hawaii uh, surfer look, and it's all in blue with with uh, uh, lays around the neck. It's, it's like everybody sort of interprets it as they wish. And, and one last question for you, Sam, and this is something that's been on my mind since I was four years old. Yes. What is your favorite kind of cookie? Well, the politically correct answer is any kind of cookie that's lovingly put out for Santa is the perfect cookie. Well, uh, out of all of the favorites, you see this cookie zone here? Uh, I have a whole bunch of uh, cookies uh, that are favorites. Uh, oatmeal raisin are always favorite. Chocolate chip, uh, the semi-sweet, uh, milk chocolate, uh, chocolate chip with nuts, um, chocolate chip with raisins, um, macadamia nuts, and uh, Oh, white chocolate with macadamia. I mean, the, how many favorite cookies are there? You didn't say snickerdoodle. Oh, right. snickerdoodle? Oh, forgive me for getting snickerdoodle cookies. Go oh, and peanut butter crunch. And oh, there's so many cookies. So the correct answer is whatever cookie the child wants to leave for Santa is absolutely the right cookie. And if they would like to leave a carrot or uh, some trail mix or something there for the reindeer, that would also be fine. And Mrs. Claus is kind of insisting that <clears throat> for the cookie zone that I do a little something extra. <clears throat> so maybe I should have the trail mix or the carrots as well. <laughs> With a few cookies on the side, right? Yes. Oh, one last thing I wanted to say about social Santas. Uh, there are over 2,000 Santas on Facebook as oh, we wow. speak. Uh, we do major collaborations. We support each other with seminars. Um, there's a big, huge chapter in the Atlanta area, the Brotherhood of the Direct Descendants of Santa, the Fraternal Order of uh, Real Bearded Santas, the International Order of Santa. Wait, you said Santa. real bearded. Are there, are there fake bearded Santas? Well, are, do you guys, like, do you not like the fake beards? We don't Is there not, tension there? A little tension, of course. But we believe that a designer beard, not fake, designer beards have their place. Not all of us are blessed with the hirsute uh, features and the follicles to be able to do a real beard. 
uh, but the magic of Santa visit is what really is important. And if that person who comes in the persona of Santa has a designer beard, so be it. It's fine with us. Well, there you have it from St. Nick himself. Thank you for stopping by today, and stay tuned for more from TechCrunch TV on Santa Claus. Ho, ho, ho. <laughs>